Baseball is a numbers game. Chapter 52. Today is Monday, October 23rd, 2023. Who were the best pitchers between 1970 and 1979? Who had the most victories, most innings pitched, most strikeouts? Most victories, wins. Jim Palmer, 186. He had 2,743 innings pitched and 1,559 strikeouts in the decade. Who had the most innings pitched? Gaylord Perry, 2,901. 184 wins. 1907 strikeouts. Who had the most strikeouts in the 1970s? Have you heard of this guy? Nolan Ryan, 2,678. That averages out to 267 strikeouts a year. Whew. Had 155 wins, 2,462 innings. Steve Carlton, 178 wins, 2,744 innings, 2,097 strikeouts. Tom Seaver, 178 wins, 2,650 innings, 2,304 strikeouts. Ferguson Jenkins, 178 wins, 2,706 in innings, 18 and 11 strikeouts. Catfish Hunter. 169 wins, 2,400 innings, 1,309 strikeouts. Don Sutton, 166 wins, 2,554 innings, 1,767 strikeouts. Phil Necro, 164 wins, 2,877 in innings, 1866 strikeouts. Noah Ryan, I mentioned him, 155 wins, 2462 in innings, 2678 strikeouts. Burt Blylevin, 148 wins, 2621 innings, 2310 strikeouts. Bob Gibson, finishing up because he pitched in the 60s. But in the 70s, 87 wins, 1441 innings. 1,046 strikeouts. Juan Marshall, he dominated the 60s. He had 191 wins in the 60s. And in the 70s, 52 more wins. 96, 961 innings, 669 strikeouts. Bruce Suter, 27 wins, 389 innings, 524 strikeouts. Jack Morris, just getting started, 21 wins, 348 innings, 189 strikeouts. And Jim Bunning, 15 wins, finishing up his career. 329 innings, 205 strikeouts. What do you think of the 1970s? I'm covering Hall of Fame pitchers. All these guys are in the Hall of Fame. Jim Palmer had the most wins in the 1970s. Baltimore Orioles won a couple titles, too. Most innings pitch was Gaylord Perry, 2,901. And the strikeouts, Nolan Ryan, 2,678. You want to know something? Nolan Ryan got started in the 1960s. He had 231 strikeouts because he came up toward the end of the decade. 1970s. 1970. He's the strikeout king. 1980s. How does he perform? We'll find out in that next video. But right now, let's recap. I like to recap because I've been doing a series of videos, best pitchers in the last 150 years, Breaking it down by decades, 10 years apart. Who wins the decade? And right now, we're in the 1970s. But I started off these video series, 1870s, and I like to recap it. 
1870 to 1879, Al Spalding. 1880s, Tim Keefe. 1890s, Kid Nichols. 1900, Christy Matthewson. 1910, Walter Johnson. 1920s, Burleigh Grimes. 1930, Lefty Grove. 1940s, Hal Newhauser. 1950s, Warren Spahn. 1960s, Juan Marshall. And then in the 1970s, the most wins, Jim Palmer. Who wins the decade of the 1980s and the 90s and 2000s and 2010? We'll get into that next video next. Remember, I'm covering Hall of Fame baseball pictures. 1970s. Very interesting. Fifteen guys. Jim Palmer, Gaylord Perry, Steve Carlton, Tom Seaver, Ferguson Jenkins, Catfish Hutter, Don Sutton, Phil Necro, Owen Ryan, Burt Blylevin, Bob Gibson, Juan Marshall, Bruce Souter, Jack Morris, and Jim Bunning. I'd like to face one of those guys. They were tough. I mean, Perry, Carlton, Seaver, Sutton, Necro, and Ryan all had over 300 wins. All right, next video, 1980s. Thanks for watching. I'm out.